What's up guys, Ryan Rigg, we're taking a look at Amazon Cloud Drive, a little setup demo and review. Is it worth it? Couple of different programs they have available. Quick Google search of Amazon Cloud Drive, I'll land you right there to the link. So we'll go ahead and go to it here. We got Prime Photos, unlimited photo storage, plus five gig for videos and files free with Prime, or there's an unlimited everything, so you can securely store all your photos, videos, and documents for just $59.99 per year. So you can start a three month trial, Get started for free. We're going to take a look at it here. I went ahead and started the three month trial there. $59.99, you can't go wrong with the unlimited photos here. We got to go ahead and download the little Cloud Drive for Mac app. You can download the desktop app, you know, if you're on Windows. I'm on Mac, so we're going to show it to you from the Mac standpoint here. So we can get the most out of Cloud Drive when we do install the app. So we're going to go ahead and do that. Download this real quick. Doesn't take but a hot second to get this downloaded install the Amazon Cloud Drive app into our applications and we can open that up and explore all the greatness packed inside Amazon Cloud Drive. Great service like I said with two options there you know five gig free if you're Amazon Prime or you can elect to pay $59.99 a year and get unlimited storage. I mean for unlimited storage for $59.99 you can't go wrong. I'll be also showing the Amazon Cloud Drive app on the iOS, on the iPhone 6. So make sure you subscribe, tune in for a future video where I show that in a full review of how that works and just some file speed transfers and things like that. So we can open this up here, we're greeted there, we can add files. There's already a folder structure kind of in place with videos, pictures, and documents. So I thought we'll do here just to get it started. We'll take a little uh, Mike like My Unboxing intro. We'll bring that over and we'll to upload that essentially to the Amazon Cloud Drive. So we can select a location that's already there, documents, pictures, or videos, or we can go ahead and create a new folder. I'm gonna go ahead and create a new folder, let's just call it test here. Those three ones uh, listed are the prefabs that are already there. So we can upload this here. It's not too large of a file, about 14 and a half megabytes. I'm actually currently uploading another YouTube video to our Gaming for Grandpa channel at the same time. So I have a pretty good connection here, 15 megabit. Uh, upload connection so depending on your connection at home will dictate your upload speed but you can see there I'm uploading to Amazon Cloud Drive and to YouTube 15 megabyte file not too not too big of a file but still download it very quickly and we'll look at a larger video file here later in the video but looking at that structure there there's that file that we uploaded there shows that it's 12.7 megabytes here but when I actually look at the file on my desktop, it's 13.3, so I'm not sure if Amazon's using some compression. I would assume so, especially with an unlimited plan for only $59.99 per year. So you can see that folder that we created there. We can click on that. We can see that's the video there. If we select there, we got some options that will appear on the bottom. We can download the file. We can upload it. We can share it to Facebook. We could just delete the file. So we'll go ahead and download it here. Doesn't take I mean, it was downloaded in pure seconds, and here we'll pull it up, and then we can actually play that right here for you guys. I had no problem streaming that right from the cloud drive. That was pretty quick, pretty easy. So we'll go back over here to our desktop, and let's look at a larger file, like 2.65 gig, a recent game file. You can see here when you're on the web-based application, when you're on Amazon.com, you see you have to use Cloud Drive for Windows or Mac to upload large files. You can only do two gig from the web browser, so no problem. We'll open up our cloud app here, and we'll just go back to that same file. And we can go ahead and click open there, and boom. Even though we are actually uploading a YouTube video, you can see the speed as it begins to do the upload to the file, to Amazon Cloud Drive. 2.5 gig file, pretty large file there. So you can see the speed, I think it's pretty quick considering I'm uploading as well. Like I said, future video I'm going to be reviewing the Cloud Drive on the from the app side, from the iOS, from my iPhone. So we'll go ahead and cancel this download and I'll do a full review so make sure, you, like I said, you're subscribed and tune in for that. But let's uh, say, for example, we bring in a photo. We just want to bring in a photo, we're back here, boom, uploads a photo really quick. Boom, our item was uploaded, so we can view our files and photos. So open photos, pop the new tab here, and then, then in the photos and video section, Amazon Cloud Drive does a great job of already organizing by date and time all your photos. So again, if you wanted to share the photo, you could do that. If you wanted to delete the photo, you could do that, and you could also put it on Facebook right here 
from the cloud drive. So like I said, in a future video when I'm using the iOS, you can actually automatically back up all your camera roll to the cloud drive automatically. So you can take a look at your storage here. You can manage it anytime. You can see the plan you have, what it's going to cost you, your storage you're using. Like I said, you can do the three month trial, $11.99 for the unlimited photos plan with this five gig or for the unlimited everything's $59.99 per year. Truly is unlimited everything. So depending on what you're looking at, my thought, is it worth it? Absolutely. Unlimited storage, high speed storage, safe, reliable, accessible across all devices. Absolutely, it's worth it. But I'm Ryan Rigg, Fast Electronic and Loud, bringing it to you Fast Electronic and of course Loud. If you enjoyed the video, please click thumbs up button, subscribe to the channel if you're not. Thanks for watching.